Hey everybody, this is Jaegerbomb, and I got you the new DLC content, the new map, the new game type, it's all here, all in one shot. Let's go. So in this game, we are playing on East End, and this is the new game type, Bounty Hunter. So the objective of this game is to collect little coins. When you collect the coins after you kill someone, you essentially get Painbringer for 5 seconds. You get Painbringer when you collect a coin for killing somebody. And you also get it for when you pick up one from your enemy dying, or you, I mean, from your teammates dying, or you dying. So, what I like about this game, this is sort of just like the Modern Warfare 3 version of Kill Confirmed. However, you get the added benefit of getting a bonus when you actually go after the coin. So there's more of an objective-based mind of, like, you should go get this. You should, like, you don't have people just sitting back, camping it out, trying to get high KDs. Because there is the oh taste steel Jaeger, so this guy liquid bliss will kill me this time And then I think he kills me another time with the freaking hatchet and I was like oh piss So I played this this uh, map as well as this game type like for the last Since it's come out Unfortunately, this is only my third or fourth game on the new map So I was really trying to wait until I could get a good gameplay on this one So this one just happened to be the one yeah, I'm not even going to tell you my score. I want you to stick out to the end because I have a new outro as well. And I hope you're, it should be something that you're going to like. So here's the invisible guy. Oh, man. Man, he's like everywhere. So let me talk to you about this class and the class specific for this game type. So me, Trotsky, Ryu, we were all just sitting in a lobby last night. We were playing for hours, I think till like 5 o'clock in the morning last night. And we were talking about like what type of class setup would be best for this game type. So here's what I came to the conclusion with. I like having the tough character. You need a little bit of speed in order to get those coins after you kill someone. So just killing a person isn't all the battle. It's about getting the coin afterwards. So to that matter, I put on the tough character as well as roller skates. So I like to be mobile. So look at me grabbing these coins, getting getting some action. So now I just got the the uh, the rampage bonus, tough not tough as nails, kill crazy and it just is awesome so I have roller skates I have a tough character but you also need health so sometimes it, like when you go to pick up those coins you take damage so I put on here I put on horse healthy so horse healthy just gives me that little added bonus of the extra health that I can have and uh, it's a really nice class and the next thing that I'm throwing you see I don't I've never put up a gameplay with this uh, support item once is the pipe bomb so a lot of times you'll get enemies just bunching up in the large groups. Um, I played a few of these games where it's like five mighties just sitting around a fucking health station. Fucking retards. So they're just sitting around health stations and I decided, well, let me try this. Let me throw on Mad Bomber and put a pipe bomb on there. And surprisingly, it was very effective in this game type. So like people were grouping up, I'd throw that pipe bomb, even if I don't kill him, with with the kill crazy on there, I was getting the extra bonus, and I was just damaging like their whole freaking team. Two piece. That's right. So I would be damaging their whole team. It was awesome. And then so I decided that's gonna be my new staple. If I'm playing this game type, you're gonna see either a pipe bomb or some type of explosive, like a jack in the box. I know one guy we were playing against was like level four hundred and ninety-three or something like that earlier. And uh, he was rocking the jack-in-the-box, and that was actually really effective. So if he saw one of his teammates die, or there was a whole group of people down, he would throw that jack-in-the-box down, and it would destroy people. And I know, he owned me a number of times. Look at this. Ooh, Bliss, you ain't getting me. You ain't getting me, Bliss. Come on, boy. Yes, sir. So I was just on rare form right here. I'll be honest with you. I had like three or four games in a row where I was just shit in the bed. I couldn't figure out how to get the game going. I couldn't quite understand this whole game type in general. But then I was like, I just gotta try this class out, and it worked out awesome. So let me talk to you guys also about this new DLC. So the new DLC comes with the East End map, which is awesome. Uh, I'm struggling to figure it out right now, but just like the 25th floor, eventually I'm gonna find my strategy, my method of how to play it, and I'm gonna go absolute ham on these guys. The other thing that it gave you was um, this new game type, Bounty Hunter. I love Modern Warfare 3 Skill Confirmed. I am so happy they brought this into this game. It is actually the only thing I've been playing since the map has come out. Through peace!
Yeah, I'm on a 15, 16 kill streak, bitches. Let's go. So I absolutely love it. Also, uh, I know that they they they're going to be be bringing out the pirates versus the uh, cowboys uh, DLC pretty soon. The the costume pack. But before that even hits, there is already a costume that's out there right now. So it's like a, some kind of pirate top. I don't know, like a pirate shirt or something like that. Um, but it costs like 2,500 costume coins, which currently I don't have that much, so I couldn't even show it to you right now. But in the future, more DLC is to come. Yeah, they're actually gonna they're gonna be bringing it out. I think it's gonna be a paid one though. I, by watching the Gotham City Imposters video, it looks like it's only gonna be like four dollars. I'm assuming two cups of coffee. Assuming all the gaming places are in California. Let's say they go to Starbucks, so it might be five bucks for the new DLC, where you can get a parrot gun, shoots out a fucking parrot. Dude, that looks awesome. You know I'll be getting that DLC when it comes out. Don't tell Miss Malibu, she'll probably get fucking pissed. But yeah, so it's going to have a parrot gun. There's some other things. The conch shell just looks absolutely badass. So I... Oh, that dude played me. So the conch shell just looks awesome. It, I think it's going to be the, the one support item that just stops those dive bombers it's the one i've been looking for this whole time i like the airspace deniers it does its job but you know the conch shell if i can knock them out of the sky before they even get a chance to get near me that is going to be awesome so yeah i'm really looking forward to the new dlc one thing though why does xbox always get this shit first microsoft what are you doing do you have that much money that you can just spend on every freaking game I would just love to be the commentator that could bring you the stuff the day it comes out, but we, I don't even get that opportunity because PlayStation's like always a week behind. Maybe it's the fact that we got hacked a few, like a couple months back, and they're trying to be more cautious about what they let out. I don't know. But, yeah. Oh, so this game's wrapped up. I went 26 and 5. Trotsky. Blitz is in my party. This is a 3 best friends series. That's right. We go 1, 2, 3, 26 and 5. New map new game type i hope you guys like this so if you guys did like this um, and you stuck around to the end wouldn't you mind dropping me a like or even if you want to subscribe if you haven't already so in the top here i'm actually listing a previous video you ha may have missed this is a fat princess dual commentary live com that i played with my buddy karavda i'm really liking this game it was a lot of fun um yeah so check that out if you haven't seen that also i have a link to my gotham city imposters playlist so I got like 45 videos on here now. So if you'd like to check those out, feel free to click those. Also, follow me on Twitter. Yes, sir, I have Twitter. It's a good way to stay updated with me and follow whenever I upload a new video. And also, you, as always, you can add me on uh, PlayStation Network and Skype so we can game together. So this has been Jaegerbomb. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later. Peace.